So last time we tried the top five donuts around New York City and you guys loved it so much. So this time we're trying five everything bagels with cream cheese from some of the best places in New York City and deciding which one we like best. Madeline, do you have a favorite already going into this? I do. I live by Murray's oh my and gosh. Brooklyn Bagel, which are like two blocks away from each other. So do you see any favorites on the table? Do you recognize any of these bagels? I do, right there, Brooklyn Bagel, and I'm so excited. I feel the exact same way. Um, I'm glad that this is not a blind tasting because I would be really nervous to not choose Brooklyn Bagel. Right, but is it your go-to? It's my go-to. I actually live a block away from it and I have one at least once a weekend, so are you ready for this? I'm so excited. But before we get started, don't forget to subscribe to Food Network by hitting the button below. What do you Let's think do about it. it, just based off of looks? Um, it's a little on the small side, mm -hmm. but it looks kind of like the perfect bagel. It's like an emoji bagel. Right? It is kind of on the like small side. I feel like New York side. bagels are like the size of your head or something. Something controversial, which I didn't realize, was whether the bagel place seeds the bottom and the top. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, I think you gotta seed every crevice. Every inch of it. Mm -hmm. So let's see. So very minimal on the bottom. I just remembered we have to rank them and I'm gonna have such trouble because I'm gonna love them all yeah. a lot. I like it, what do you think? I think it's a pretty good standard mm -hmm. bagel. It's got like a good crisp. It's got everything that you want from a bagel. You know, like the little crunchy outside, mm -hmm. it's chewy on the inside. It's on the breadier side, like the dough on the inside, once you get past that first crunchy bite, yeah. is really soft and chewy. Mm -hmm. I think I could do with a little bit more seeds on the outside. It's very poppy heavy. I'm thinking more just the everything component of mm -hmm. it. I like an everything kind of mix that has more salt to it. I was about to say, and this that isn't that salty. I would eat this. This, I is, would. this is good. Noticing off the bat, mm -hmm. it's giant. Yes, and that's why I like it. I want a bagel that's the size of my head. Compared to this, right? Mm -hmm. It's funny. Brooklyn Bagel actually sells a mini bagel, really, and it's this size. Seeds on the bottom. Ooh, I like this already. It's, I feel like it's like it's weight. It's, it's weight. Got it's weight got some it. weight to it. Some heft. Mmm. Yeah. There's the salt. Just the best. You don't get anything better than this. Mm -hmm. This just tastes like. Ah. A Saturday morning to me. The thing they master is it's still a little doughy on the inside, mm -hmm. which I don't know. Some people might be like, "Is that is that a little underdone?" But it's mm -hmm. perfect. It's also again just going back to like the seasoning of it. Mm -hmm. This is what I want. It's covered, and the seeds really add that whole flavor profile. Right off the bat, where are the seeds? Well, they, there's actually a lot more on the bottom, oh. seed wise, than the top. So they really went heavy on the bottom Curve of it. Curveball. I feel like we could already tell so much just by the weight and feel of things. So yeah. I'm just like kind of giving it a little. Well, this is also the most well done so far. I'm like, I'm not mad at it, but I'm not in love. I can't believe what's happening. <laughs> my favorites are falling down. So to me, this is my third place so far. See, I think I liked it better than the absolute. This one just is a little heavier. This kind of had a light feel to it that I wasn't mm -hmm. expecting. Yeah, I kind of like a heavy bagel though. Mm -hmm. Like when I want a bagel, like I want carbs. I want something to sit in my stomach. Like I want to be satisfied. And I feel like this would satisfy me more than that one if I ate the whole thing. Just from looking at it, Murray's almost looks like it cooked for too long. Harder to eat than it's I It's a little want. harder. You know why? Because I think the top, because it, it does have a, a crispy yeah. nips to it. These yeah. all. These all have like a good healthy amount of cream cheese on them, and that's not helping this one. No, out. I wouldn't really call this an everything bagel. No, it's a plain bagel that was it's dragged on It's a plain bagel that like seeds. has a sprinkle of seeds. Mm -hmm. The texture is better than I remembered. I'll say. Yeah. It has the crispiest outside. The like fact is, yeah. if I had gone in blind to any of these with no other bagels to compare them to, I'd be thrilled. Um, first of all. It's much darker than the other bagels. Mm -hmm. This looks like Ooh, the, this is the for most me. This is seasoned, seasoning quite, all of them. quite nicely. And Look at also, the bottom; it's just yeah, like covered. it looks the best of all of them. Oh, I like this. This is quite good. It's a no for me, dog. I don't even want to talk to you because there was so much garlic in that. My breath is oh, I didn't horrendous. even mind the garlic. Oh, there's so much of it. It's just like it's everything enough. It's like chewy enough. It's seasoned enough. It's garlickier. It's garlickier, which I appreciate on the garlicky side versus mm -hmm. the salty side. So yeah, like that's a preference. All this comes down to really, really nitpicky preferences. We yes. gave everyone a fair chance, mm -hmm. but sometimes there's just something that reigns supreme, mm -hmm. and there's no arguing it. And three, one, two, three. Brooklyn, Brooklyn Bagel. Bagel. Brooklyn bagel. bagel. It doesn't get any better. No. In the head-to-head -head battle, they clearly clearly surpassed the others. Chewy, ginormous, packed with cream cheese. Yeah, just look at that. Just a beautiful bagel. Oh, I'm gonna have let's just bite. keep it. I know. Yeah, this is too good not to. 
We hope you like this video and we hope you let us know in the comments down below which New York City food we should try next. Bye.